He went to the ballpark hoping to catch a foul ball. Instead, a 12-year-old baseball fan got hit in the face by the ball. Tonight, he's doing better, especially after getting a surprise visit from the player who hit that line drive. Eyewitness News reporter Lucy Yang got an exclusive hospital interview with the patient and his mom. It is a foul ball heading straight for the fans. No time to react, no time to put up his hands or duck his head. Within four seconds, the ball smashes into Eli Shalomov's nose, and the 12-year-old goes down hard. All I kept on hearing was crying and yelling and blood coming out of everywhere. It was the ninth inning last night. City Field, the first of a Mets Marlins doubleheader. Greg Dobbs from the Florida Marlins up at bat. The Shalomovs, thanks to free now tickets, are sitting Dobbs. in prime right field Hold seats. Foul. Immediately, Dobbs ran to check on the injured child, gave him his bat, and today followed through with a long personal hospital visit. It was cool. It was cool. Was he kind to you? Yeah. He was amazing. He was really, he was really, really nice. He was down to earth. I'm told Ellie suffered a fractured sinus, broken nose, and needed eight stitches. Doctors and his family hoping he won't require surgery. This worried mother believes the stadium could learn a lesson from her son's pain. She would like to see protective nets installed up front. I can't think of having to come to a baseball game, needing life insurance. In addition to Dobbs' bat and a signed ball, Mets second baseman Justin Turner last night gave his jersey to the bleeding child. In Queens, Lucy Yang, Channel 7 Eyewitness News.